hi guys welcome to my channel hope you're doing well so this reading will be for you if you have aries as your sun moon venus rise and north node or if you're dealing with an aries please remember to give the video a thumbs up if it resonates if you enjoyed the reading okay guys let's see what's going on with you guys today aries aries oh and if you'd like a private reading please check the description box below all the information is there okay guys all right, let's see what's going on. Oh, straight away. Knight of Wands has come out. Knight of Wands. All right, what's this Knight of Wands doing? What's this Knight of Wands doing? Someone in and out, someone not sticking around. Or only for fun, yeah? Thanks. Six of Cups, the star. Okay, so we have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio here, and we have Aquarius. Do you know what? Do I even say shit? Thanks. Temperance. Yeah. Okay, so I feel like someone right now is a bit um, conflicted. Someone's a bit conflicted. They they not sure not sure how to move forward. Um, something from the past is holding them back. They're thinking very much about the past. Yeah, um, with the star and temperance. Oh, so we've got Aquarius, Sagittarius there person's okay so i'm getting somebody's trying to find their um their passion for life again someone's trying to find peace within themselves someone's moving so quick because they're they're not sure where they're going when you really know your journey there's no need to rush 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 you just you know flow naturally but some someone's like almost running from something so like somebody's running from something from their past Aries. Someone's not um facing something, someone's like hiding something or not um looking. Someone's someone's avoiding doing shadow work is what I'm getting. Could it could be you Aries, it could be somebody that you're dealing with. Okay, so these are turned around, so I'll take those. So we have the Seven of Wands. We have the Seven of Wands. The Lovers. So we have Aries, Gemini, Lib um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We have Gemini here, and we have Capricorn. Yeah. Okay. It's just like confirmation of what I was just saying. So somebody, yeah, they're quite guarded. They're not, they're not, um, you know what? I'm, I'm actually looking at that differently today, the seven of wands. So yes, I see that as being guarded, but I'm also, I'm, all, I'm also seeing people coming towards you for help, um, offering, offering help, or you could be offering somebody help, but someone saying, no, 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 I'm fine. And then behind closed doors is a total mess. It's not fine. It's not okay. Something, something's left undealt with. Yeah, the love is the devil. So um, it could, it could be a relationship. Okay. Someone could be hiding the relationship. I'm getting that somebody's um. Oh yeah. Oh my God, guys, if you, oh. all right, some of you Aries, um, I would definitely say like, be careful who, who you have kids with, yeah? Be careful who you have kids with. Be careful who you're having sex, like, sexual encounters with, yeah? Because this, this person's coming out as toxic. This Gemini is coming out as toxic, yeah? Yeah, and it's quite, yeah, mm. Mm. 
Some of you have kids with a Capricorn. I feel like it's a very, very passionate thing, but I don't know if it's like, I think it's good for, I'm getting like it's good for your ego, but it's bad for your soul. Now let's see what this says. So you have four of cups, knight of swords. Yeah, I'm getting that someone said, I told you, I, I wanted nothing serious. I didn't want something serious, knight of swords, four of cups. You know, you knew this wasn't going anywhere. Seven of wands, four of cups, you know it wasn't going anywhere. So why do you continue to, to, to talk to me about this? Why is this still a conversation? Why is this still... Cause so, so, right, so I'm getting that somebody's... Um, being strung along someone knows what the situation is and the other person knows but it's like it keeps on happening repeating the situation this this sex sexual encounters this fling it keeps on happening and somebody's caught feelings and the other person saying to the person who caught feelings you knew what this was or even if they're not saying it their actions are saying it the actions are speaking much louder right now because they're in and out they're in and out they don't want to have a proper conversation about this. Whenever they're somebody, whoever this is, I don't know if it's you, Aries, or somebody that you're dealing with. But somebody's not willing to have a conversation with this. They're very guarded. They just don't want to hear it. They don't, they don't want to know. Someone's very much feeding into their, um, this toxic behaviour, this repetitive cycle. It could, it doesn't have to be a Gemini, but I feel like there is a lot of, like, I'm getting a lot of sex. There's a lot of sex. This person, this knight of wands, is having a lot of sex. And they're creating life. They're creating children. But it's not coming from a, from a good place. This person... Mm. This person wants nothing serious. Somebody's in love and other person's just not... In, yeah, they're not. They're not interested. Thank you. Thank you. Page of Cups, yeah, they might say, they might say, oh, how are you doing and stuff like that. When they notice that some someone's cold here, someone somebody has detached, yeah, and somebody's trying to butter that person up. The Page of Cups is trying to butter up the Queen of Swords, yeah, and it could be a mother, it could be a mo the mother of their children. I just feel like it's sexual based. There's somebody who's really not grown up here. There's someone who's really not grown up and who doesn't want to take uh, responsibility for the life that they've created. It's like when they do come in, they're coming in as pages, knights, the damn devil, you know, all this sexual energy. But it's like that's all there is. There's nothing more to it. There's like even if they said it is, it like you feel, you feel, you see that it's not. Thank you. Two of Swords. Some of you guys are like really, really trying to understand like what is this about? Why does this person keep, keep you bound to them? It's for sex. I think someone's got a sex addiction, addiction here. And I feel like they do that to make themselves feel good. Ten of swords. But they're only hurting themselves. They only end up hurting themselves. Well, they hurt other people as well. But they're not... It's not doing anything, it's not accomplishing anything by having sex with all these people or with somebody that you don't love. It's not it's not helping you. It's not helping you or them. Whoever this is, I don't know who it is, guys. I don't know if it's if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with. I have one more card. One more card. Turned around there. What is that? King of Pentacles. Three of Wands. Somebody's using someone for money. Someone needs to be stable and not rely on other people. It's like someone just waiting around. Oh, okay, I get it. Someone's a womanizer. They're going around to different women, sleeping with them, trying to get their fortune. 
and just hoping that the love that they're given or not given or whatever this energy will make them um make these women or men stay around is no i'm gonna leave it there guys please like share subscribe bye